how do we evaluate the kind of morality or justice of, of inflation in terms of its, its redistributive effects? We don't. I mean, uh, do, you, do you see it being debated? Um, I think one should, maybe one should debate this in terms of um, uh, in, should the government run an inflationary policy to reduce the real value of at least the long-term debt or just repudiate. Um, and obviously these have different distrib uh, distributional impacts. Um, but um, uh, given that the distributional effects is, uh, are different, uh, you could ask uh, uh, the, the groups that are hurt the most, uh, uh, in this case and in that case, which group can afford it the best or something like that. But for the United States, it's almost as unthinkable to uh, openly repudiate uh, government debt as it would have been for you know, the British Empire <laughs> to, <laughs> to, to, to do so 150 years ago, or, you know. The, uh, um, But the inflation is largely that, of course, to have a, have a, have a significant impact on the debt burden by inflating. Uh, uh, what the, it's very important to look at what the maturity structure of the debt really is, because uh, most of the, uh, the all the short term is going to be rolled over at higher interest rates and so on. And, and, and it's mostly the long-term debt that you're expropriating. Yeah, I guess I'm just thinking, you know, I think it was in, in at the INET conference in Berlin several years ago, uh, you talked about, I remember you said something to the effect that a crisis is a situation where some contracts are not going to be fulfilled. That's sort of what you find the contract. A, a crisis is that not every commitment can be actually on it. And then you're sort of inevitably faced with a choice of which commitments do we wish to uphold and which ones are we going to have to allow and it seems like again you need to have some notion of justice or fairness or some other criteria to, to, to decide that uh, and, uh, and uh, that, uh, of course a fundamental difficulty right because the, uh, there is a structure of law which is supposed to embody the, the uh, uh, concepts of fairness that the society adheres to and uh, and now you're debating which way am I going to to violate, to, that. to violate that and what can be fair or unfair about that so uh, uh, there are going to be very clear answers